So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to do the easiest way to tie a snelled rig. So really good for your kingfish, jew, snapper, all that sort of thing. Um, good for live baits and dead baits. So another thing I'll be doing in this video is showing you how to actually put your baits, your live baits and dead baits on the rig, on the snell rig. So let's get into it. So the first thing you're gonna do is just chuck one of your hooks over there and focus on this one now. Now the easiest way and I think best way to tie on your bottom hook here is to go up through the back, the offset back, and you're just gonna tie a blood knot or a uni knot or something like that that you would just normally use to attach one hook. So for the blood knot, we're just gonna go around the line six times. And then we're gonna go through the loop we've made, just as you can see there, just above the eyelet of the hook. I'm gonna put the tag through there. And then back through that one there that we've just made. Then what we're gonna do is wet it with a bit of saliva and then pull that tight. And what you're gonna do is just trim the little tag end off there that you can see. There you have it, there's one hook on. So now what we have to do is cut our trace or our leader at the length we want it. So for the purpose of the video, I'm not gonna waste my leader, but I guess you could go for about 75 centimeters if you're using a swivel and a sinker or even a few meters sort of if you're doing a um, braid to leader knot so I'll just trim it off now we're going to grab the other end of the the leader the top there and thread this up through the eye with that hook there now depending on the size of your bait um, will determine how far apart these are. So if it's a bigger bait, obviously they'll be further apart. If it's a smaller bait, they'll be closer. Obviously these hooks are massive, just to show you guys. So now that you've got this hook here tied on, you're gonna leave that one out of the way. Get this one at the right length. And then what you're gonna do is pinch the line down the back of the hook here. Pinch that tight. So then you're holding it like that. And you're just gonna grab this line at the front and wrap it down around like this. Obviously these are big hooks, so I'll probably do it a fair few times, all the way down sort of thing. Pull it up towards the top. Towards the top. I'm just doing a lot here for the purpose of the video and these hooks are massive. So there we go, now that we've got that, what you can do just hold that tight there for a second with your thumb and then what you're going to do with this is go down through the top of that one there pull it and you're going to pull it tight get that knot in nice and tight and there you have it the snell rig. Now something you can do is with this top hook if you want you can just add a little sinker to the top here right at the top of this hook so for example if you're going to float down a big pilly or a slimy mackerel or something so now that you've actually got your rig tied it's time for me to bring out Mr Yakka and um, show you how to rig up your baits. The first way you can do it is you can just put your hook up through its top lip like this so it's sitting there like that and then you can have that one sitting there and your other one just pin it just through the back obviously these hooks are massive for what it is but you can have your bait sort of like that now obviously like I said you can rig dead baits on on this so for example if, if this was a pilchard or even a yakka a big dead yakka so there's a couple of ways you can do it. 
you can do it head first. You can have those sitting in there like that. So that's how you can put a dead bait on it. Or once again, you could have the top hook, this one here that's in the eye, you could start that down here and then have the bottom one down this end sort of thing. So it actually might sink better that way head first if you want to float it down. But yeah, so there you go. That's the Snelled rig and how to put your baits on with it. Hope you enjoyed. Um, if you did, hit that subscribe button, like the video, and see you next time. Cheers, guys.